Hello and welcome to Polymer Update. This is Simran Chaudhary and you're watching Polymer Update TV, the world's first and only TV network with a free petrochemicals news show. Our special news reel today is sponsored by Ahmedabad based Sumiran Master Batch Private Limited. Let's start with domestic market news. Indian PS producer has reduced prices by 2 rupees 50 pesa per kg basic with effect from March 11, 2019. Moving on to energy and feedstock news. Crude oil prices dropped last Friday on the back of negative economic data emerging from China and the US. Brent finished at $65.74, a decline of 56 cents per barrel, while WTI traded at $56.07, a fall of 59 cents per barrel. According to Vandana Hari of Fanda Insights, Crude prices were ticking up early Monday in Asia, on the heels of bullish comments on supply and demand over the weekend from Saudi Energy Minister Khalid Al Fale and high OPEC compliance with its output cuts, while a mixed open to the region's stock markets also lent some support. Saudi Energy Minister Khalid Al Fale, speaking to reporters in New Delhi on Sunday, struck a bullish tone saying global oil demand was set to grow by a strong 1.5 million barrels per day year-on-year year in 2019, with Chinese consumption breaking new records and expected to reach 11 million barrels per day this year. Open spec NAFTA prices also slipped last Friday, falling by 9 US dollars per metric ton to the 540 US dollars per metric ton CFR Far East Asia levels. Despite stronger upstream energy values, ethylene prices plunged in Asia last week. Prices tumbled mainly on account of plentiful product availability, coupled with dull buying interest across the Asian region. CFR Northeast Asia prices were assessed lower at the 1065 US dollars per metric ton levels, a whooping drop of 120 US dollars per metric ton from the previous week. CFR Southeast Asia prices of ethylene were assessed lower at the 965 US dollars per metric ton mark, a steep week on week tumble of 100 US dollars per metric ton. Propylene prices drifted lower in Asia last week. The price drop was prompted by ample regional product avails and weaker demand sentiments. FOB Korea prices of propylene were assessed at the 900 US dollars per metric ton, a week on week decline of 10 US dollars per metric ton. CFR China prices of propylene were assessed at the 910 US dollars per metric ton levels, a fall of 15 US dollars per metric ton from the previous week. Let's take a look at futures on China Dalian Commodity Exchange for today on March 11, 2019. LLDPE prices are higher by 5 RMB per metric ton at 8,655 RMB per metric ton. PP rates are up by 9 RMB per metric ton at 8,737 RMB per metric ton. PVC prices are lower by 20 RMB per metric ton at 6,550 RMB per metric ton. In plant news, Nissan Refinery and Petrochemical has shut its 400,000 metric ton per year PP unit located at Nissan Vietnam on March 3, 2019 owing to technical issues. The unit is expected to remain offline for around 10 days. Polymer Update has introduced news and price analysis on Amazon Alexa Virtual Assistant using Echo and other devices. The platform lets subscribers check latest news and prices just by asking Echo or any other Alexa-enabled device. This is the first of its kind on Amazon Alexa, so do read the kind of questions that you can ask to Amazon Alexa about Polymer Update. Our special news reel today is sponsored by Ahmedabad-based Sumitran Master Batch Private Limited, a manufacturer wholesaler and distributor of color master batches, PE master batches, blow flame master batches, color granules, lamination, multi-layer lamination, etc. That's all for today's Polymer News. Watch our daily news video tomorrow to know more. It is Monday, March 11. I'm Simran Chaudhary. Thank you. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash Polymer Update and be sure to click the like button. You can also find us on Twitter at Polymer Update. For the latest news from the plastics and petrochemicals industry, subscribe to our YouTube channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon.